Here's what I want to do tonight. I want you to launch into the deep. I will not stand here. If you call me the grandfather of this house, I will not stand here and allow you to miss God's best. I will not do it. I declare it will not happen. Your ship will launch. You'll come back with the treasures of this world and others will laugh. Child of God, please hear me. When, Jesus, when Simon Peter, after missing all night fishing and catching nothing, he went again, the people said, you're a fool. But remember, when Jesus went to the house of Tabitha to bring her into life again, they said, you fool. You fool. But Tabitha walked. Tabitha walked. Oh, my God. Listen to me. And Simon Peter prospered. I've come home. Ah, this is my home. Pastor Kong is my pastor. I stand with him all across the world. I am a member of this church. Go anywhere and ask where I'm a member. No place. I always say, I am in City Harvest. Now listen, the Bible tells us don't wait for the perfect time to sow. Don't wait. It tells us in Ecclesiastes 11, 4, uh, uh, do not observe the wind. You're not going to sow if you do. And if you regard the clouds, you will never reap. My goodness. Rainy weather, sunshiny weather. The truth is sometimes we have rain in the summer, rain in the fall. We have rain. It looks like there's never going to be a stop to the rain. But let me say this out there. If you believe in God, there is a great bright day coming. It can't miss. It came for Joseph. Oh, child of God. When you call me grandfather, it's no little word. I feel that I have responsibility here. I am a son of this house. I stand with it. But hear me, please. It's time to sow. But we say, tomorrow. We'll do it tomorrow. We'll do it when the sun shines a little brighter. Child of God, remember, Pharaoh said tomorrow, his ship never sailed. Lot's wife looked back and said, this is not a good time to leave Sodom. And she turned to a pillar of salt. Her ship never sailed. But in this great house, as I've come since you were a little crowd, just some little guys, I've seen you grow into this great church of God. I've seen you overcome all kinds of obstacles. And you will overcome now. I speak it. I speak it. You will overcome now.